guys, welcome back to a brand new Grand Summoners video. Now, I have really, really been enjoying this game, and yeah, I'm just slowly getting a load of free bits and pieces to start off with here. And um, they've just recently started a Halloween event now. Lucky Gen, sign in bonus, one punch man promos, fantastic. That's just some people sharing stuff as well, which is great. So, I wanted to kind of give you a bit of an update, because I've been spamming through this over the weekend. So I've now got Genos to 86, I've got um, Sup and 120 luck, I've got Supersonic to 97 luck and level 70, slowly leveling up, and the next character I want to increase is Terrible Tornado. So with that, I need to Limit Breaker next, but I just need to save up a million gold. But actually, you know... Um, no, not limit break. Sorry, it's evolve, isn't it? So evolve. I wonder how close I am. So I need, yeah, I need the million gold. So I'm, I'm quite close there. So basically, what I need to focus on here is basically running through and doing loads more of the gold modes. So I know I did a video on this before, guys. Um, but let's just see um, how many coins and stuff I've got. So the most important thing to do when you're doing this and. Um, I will be doing a few more One Punch Man summoning stakes. I'm guaranteed a five star. Because I had a lot of people talking about... Um, just wonder if they had any Halloween packs in, but they don't. I've had a lot of people talking about um, every week they reset. One Punch my... Oh, there's a new summon thing. So, how does this work? 25, 50, 50, 50. So that is a lot of money. But you get loads of the crystals and guaranteed oh this just the drop rate increases each time and then you're guaranteed one it's not awful but not really that great either to be honest with you okay so let's jump in and do um yeah because that's the one I, I was going to do as well um but i decided away from that because you weren't guaranteed anything Okay, anyway, so let's get into this. And, yeah, so it seems like once a week it resets and you're guaranteed a 5 star from what I gathered in the comments. So let's do my summoning here and let's hope I get Satama. That's the last character I need. Come on, it's be multicolored. It's not multicolored. So I, I think that means I'm only going to get one as it is a guarantee. Now, is he going to come up twice? No, he didn't. Okay, so I'm only going to get one from this. But let's see what we can do. I mean, I don't really need another one of him. Um, let's lock him down anyway. But yeah, I got another Garu, which I guess is better than nothing. But that was still... <sighs> that could have been a lot better, really. You know, that was not extremely great, unfortunately. But yeah, that's not, that's not awful, is it? So, you know, this might be quite good to actually do. Um, next time because you're guaranteed to get a maxed out five star weapon So I, I might actually consider doing that instead of summoning now because I think my chance of getting um, Say it now guys is just non-existent like it's just So annoying to get anything good now So um, let's go back and let's, let's do a couple of gold battles like because I mean my, my team is absolutely smashing along guys I hope they convert into something eventually. But a lot of you were also saying, um, if I go into my units here, I, a lot of you were saying that I got a really good one. So let's just sort by um, uh, five stars only, whatever. So I think it was this one. So negate all eyes damage for 120 for uh, terrorism and. HP auto recovery. Oh no, that's not it. There was another character unlocked. And all of you were saying she was like the best healer. Well, who's this guy? So I got Lunda as well. So you can see my five star characters on this screen here, guys. Um, they're not all terrible. But I've also got some off ones. So let's um, sort because I know there were some characters that I got which had that um, five star, five star awoken.
It must have been her. It must have been her, yeah. I'm going to lock these all for now because I haven't really decided on what I'm going to be doing with my um, best characters. So let's get, I'm going to get them all locked. So I don't want to ever accidentally get rid of any of them. So at the moment, I don't really know why you'd need two of the same character. I think that's because most of these characters I have here are all kind of maxed out. So it, it doesn't really work having two of the same character. But anyway, I don't think anything I've got there is awful. But yeah. Let's see. Who's this person? So yeah, I, I, I think the team I've got at the moment is pretty solid, guys. Um, and I'm gonna, I will upgrade that healer. Because like I said, a lot of you were saying that she's the best healer in the game. Um, because look, she does here. Negate all allies damage for a total of 2,500, which is mad. And HP auto recovers by 100. That's her art skill. Now skill heals all eyes HP by 100. Increase own art gauge by 3. Which gets her up quicker to use her special. So ideally I guess the point is there. That you can keep looping and looping and looping and looping. And just smashing her levels up. So yeah. Um, let's auto manage. And then let's auto manage my equipment as well. Because now I've got supersonic and genesis gear up. And I've started to smash up. Um, I've done, I did hers by quite a decent amount as well. Um, Terra Tornadoes. Because if I go into the Evolve, I think I need one more of the Crystals to Limit Breaker now. And then I'm nearly there. So, yeah, I've got one. Oh no, she's already on five. So I don't want to waste that on her. Cool. So now I need to, I want to use those Luck Crystals that I had on him. So I want to get him up to, um... 120 luck now as well. So let's just do that a couple times. Great. And Ooh. I want to first still focus on upgrading Genos um, with the materials I have. I don't have any of the actual good ones for now. So it would be a waste to use those on him. I mean, that's a fair chunk of XP, but the colors don't match. So it is not much point. So yeah, a lot of you are commenting asking me what I was doing with my team. There's the answer for you guys. The next thing I'm working on is Supersonic to get him up to the max level. Um, I did another summoning. It wasn't really that great. Um, but yeah, I'm going to max these characters out. I might swap Boris off for that healer. Um, but yeah, I'm curious to know your guys' opinion on that one. So I'm still a little bit kind of in between with that. Like I'm not too sure on who I should level up. But no, guys, this is a, a quick video of just updating my progress over the weekend. Hope you've enjoyed it. And I want to know um, what you guys' favorite character is. And also, um, guys, I want to know if, if I go into town, and I go into... Is this one? I want to know, guys, um, who I should redeem in here. I want you guys to comment down below and let me know what character is the best out of all of these. And then I'll, I'll grab them. So I want someone who's obviously played the game a lot to let me know who the best character is. Comment down below, guys. Let me know and I'll grab them. And same for the redeem of the true gear. Which one should I grab? I want to get one of those books, which like... So actually, that one's really good. Um, I should put that on my healer or something like that. But let me know, guys. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you beautiful people all in the next one.